All right, we are back with Naveen with France and Lokmanyu with France as well. Now, of course, there's there's nothing to um, there's nothing to separate these two teams because they are literally the same. It's only uh, going to be the player selection that is going to be probably different for, for both the guys. What both of them should only more than that have uh, differences in the positions where they're playing their players from at Dembele seems to be the striker here uh, for uh, Naveen and uh, yeah I mean it's a strange selection but I, I guess Dembele with his body type should be really when he was just setting up his camera making sure that everything's functioning and we have the second leg uh, sorry, we have uh, the big, big, big quarterfinal game now, which is Naveen versus Lokmanyu. Lokmanyu, like I already said, one of the most recognizable names in our country. If you talk about FIFA pros in our country, you would definitely name Lokmanyu in one of them. Alongside Naveen, again, one of those guys from Chennai, just like Vicky, extremely talented at the game. Very, very, very um, high finishes in the weekend league last year as well. So it's going to be it's going to be a game that is going to be extremely intense. This is not this is not going to be like the game that Lokanu played versus Dhruv. Dhruv was a guy who was able to who he was able to dominate very easily. This is going to be a completely different game. Here, both the players are going to look to dominate. They both know the quality that they each possess. And Naveen is not going to be rattled. Neither is Lokmanyu. They both have faced each other, I am sure, multiple times in competitive um, tournaments like this one. And this is something where, this is where the matches get really, really, really exciting for the neutrals to watch. And extremely difficult, sadly, for the uh, players who are going to be playing this game. But I hope that we find we we have a very, very, very um, advent, uh, fun game at at our hands. Um, this one, Lokmanyu, with trusting Dembele at the striker position, Martial and Koman at the left mid and right mid, just making sure all his tactics are correct. Four, 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 four. A very, very, very balanced balanced tactic. Um, where everyone is on comeback on defense because in the 4-4-2 it does get a little difficult to actually uh, to actually get this done like uh, get your defense uh, be compact because the left man and the right man if they don't come back to defend it's going to be a very 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 difficult time so you need all your left mids and the right mids to be able to track the wingers and the central players for pressing because that's the that's what makes the 4-4-2 so good this year. It's the it's the way that it can hold out the defense and be so fluid in the attack, especially with the two for, for striker formation that is very much needed this year. The two strikers are able to play one twos amongst each other and release through balls, which are so effective this year. And this this team of France has has multiple players capable of using that meta now we have kickoff of one of the most exciting games uh, that we're going to be witnessing today Lokmanyu versus Naveen and we have kickoff Lokmanyu does not have the kickoff Naveen starting off Pavard uh, to Duba Duba waiting waiting sir Lokmanyu is going to be playing a very different game, by the way. Lokmanyu knows that he he knows that the quality that he has and he has to respect it. Uh, because if he does try to go overboard with the press, just like he did in the last game uh, with Dhruv, he got completely exposed on the wings there and he was able to give um, Dhruv so many chances with, with the uh, wingers, with the skills that he possesses. They just led to two very easy goals that, that Lokmanyu would honestly be able to defend quite easily in any other circumstance. So he knows that pushing those fullbacks forward is, is a risky, risky business. Lokmanyu with a great chance here, but very good defending by Naveen here. But yeah, as you can see, it's, it's going to be a very, very close affair this game. I, I can be sure of it. Both the players of extremely high quality. 
Naveen played a flawless game and Lopanyu did have his his troubles against Dhruv but he managed to clutch up in the last 10 minutes and of course the next game which went to golden goal Lopanyu trying to press he's keeping the ball with the defenders he knows that he has to find the right pass he can't lose it there he can't lose it at the half line because that if he manages to lose the ball there there's, there's going to be genuinely no stopping attacks from lokman you are taking two mistakes and you definitely have a goal in at least one of them the, this is the level that these guys play at mistakes are not forgiven at all and that is exactly what both of these players would want to avoid because honestly that is how i would see a goal happening you can see that they both are very very um kg in the first few minutes of the game that they're, they're just feeling the opponents out they're seeing how they're choosing to deal with certain situations are they pressing are they jockeying what is their reaction are they pushing their full backs forward all of this information can come in handy um going forward into the game a decent attack there it did come to absolute nothing but lokman you would want to now counter but again as you can see he is not rushing it at all lokman you knows that if he continues to rush things he will end up losing the ball without creating a good chance and he wants to create high percentage chances that are going to result most likely in goals and he will look for that pass and another pass that looks like a goal and what a save that is by hugo loris that 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 opened up so well for him and this is what patience brings you this is all patient gameplay and its fruit because he waited for that perfect run and he got rewarded for it almost in fact did not result in a goal but definitely put navin in a very 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 difficult position there navin with some good passing himself a great chance by mbappe and he chooses to not do a skill move at the end there shoot straight at the keeper two very good chances on both ends here pogba with the incredible press there kante to koman going back to his wing back mbappe twisting turning left stick dribbling good pass to koman to dembele L1 R1 and that is a penalty for Lokman you who has started this game so well can he finish he chooses to go with Mbappe he chooses to go right and it's saved by Naveen that was such a good opportunity to for Lokman you to start dominating this game and he misses the pen a good save by Naveen but he did deserve a goal there because the the l1 r1 directional completely sold him there and it was going to be an open net for him to score even though we have seen some extremely um extremely um rare misses today but it was a very high percentage chance that it was going to go in and the penalty is sadly safe for lokman you and navin want push back and show that he is not out of this game yet he would want to, he he knows now that the momentum is in on his side he knows that he has had this was a boost in his confidence and this was a dent in lokman news even though lokman he knows he's been playing so well he'll he'll be somewhere at, at the back of his head but these guys are so strong mentally because this is exactly what he'll overcome and i'm sure of it lokman you in the attack trying to get the goal that he did deserve mbappe twisting and turning again he, you just never know where he's going to go because he's so light on the ball to use koman on the ball to kante back to koman to kante looks for that pass to dembele and easy fix shots oh my god what a finish that is from dembele the strike the power top bins extremely good goal from lokman you there he was so patient and it finally paid off a fake fake shot to the back and it completely sold his defender he never expected that to go in sorry he never expected him to turn that way 
and a very deserved goal for uh, Lopenu here. Naveen has not really created anything since a long time now. It's all been Lopenu, and he really has stepped up his game from the last one. He knows that he cannot take any of this lightly, and he's come in here in top form. Martial trying to rush an attack, but he gets the ball back to Dembele. A very solid half by Lokmanu there. You can see that he's a little annoyed, but you know, you know, he knows that he's done well. He knows that he's dominated the game. He knows that he's had good enough chances in this game. He's having that sip of water, preparing himself for the next half. 4 4 2, 4 4 2, of course. A few changes here or there in their teams, but overall, identical. Naveen would also be sipping water. In fact, he should take a couple of sips. He knows he's down and he knows he has to make a comeback to have a fighting chance in this game. I mean, it would be amazing for, I mean, from a neutral's point of view, this should at least be a 2-2 game. And then we go for the final goal in the 70th minute or so or the 75th minute to make it even more interesting. Let's hope that does happen though. It looks like still a very cagey affair. A lot of respect shown by both opponents for each other. Not too many risks taken. And that is understandable. That is a cheap giveaway of possession though. I mean, that's not really risk taking. Uh, Naveen uh, has a chance. He plays the ball out wide to Koman. Stops. Yedder held the ball so well there. Kante. Holding the ball, holding the ball, trying to find the right opportunity. Koman to Kante. Waiting. No one's making a run and Kante loses the ball to Kante. <laughs> Things you love to see. Kante with a great press there for Naveen. Benny Edda with the ball. He tries to turn. What a pass that is, but well read by Lokmanu there. And on the counter, he goes. Good counter here. He's, he's trying to slow things down again. Kante, the menace. Kante has been, he's been performing so well for both the teams. Dini again with a great tackle there. This is, this is such a cagey affair. It feels like this uh, affair, just, just, it's just a midfield affair, essentially. Like, this is a game to be won in the midfield because both of the midfield is performing so well. Uh, I mean, this has opened up a little space for Koman here. Can he make the right pa uh, pa de decision to pass? Mbappe with a great chance. Yedder has to go back. Can't really turn there. There were too many defenders in genuinely good positions and he has lost the ball. Lokmanu showing some really, really, really good um, defending here. Dembele passes the ball off to Yedder. Yedder again, just not good enough. I feel like for Naveen, this Ben Yedder is not really uh, been the best player just as he thought he would because he lacks the little pace that the other cars bring to the table and maybe it plays in his head that it's four-star skill move. I'm not sure. He just he hasn't uses he's he hasn't used Benny Eder like the others have. Benny Eder with another chance here though. Mbappe. That's amazing defending. Lokmanu has looked so solid at the back. It's time that he starts keeping the ball. He does go on a counter though. Martial stops, plays the ball off, or does not. I mean he does eventually play the ball off to Pogba. A croquetta there. Martial has been fighting for the ball. Like I said, Martial's physical presence is a huge deal on the wings there. It brings in a lot, lot of quality and in those 50-50s. And uh, that's exactly what, what was shown in that particular sequence there. And if Lokmanu actually managed to score that goal, it's, it's all Martial that came from Dainier with a very good tackle though. Dembele, Pogba, to Mbappe, to Kante, to Dubois. It's been a very, very cagey affair. It's the 70th minute. 
one of them has to push for a goal and ideally that has to be navin he can't he cannot be just uh, playing the game like he has been because it's not been enough pressure being that's being put on lokman you uh, yes he has been able to stop lokman you um in 99% of his attacks but it's it's just not good enough he can, you can see that he has his full backs overlapping which was exactly something he had to do uh to actually have a fighting chance in this game but can he make anything out of it no he cannot one more bite at the cherry dembele with the ball pogba passes it to yedder and kanté again there dinie trying to press as you can see the pressure is now out a great ball to kanté and it's all gates open for lokmanyu what can he do he chooses to wait he loses the ball very cheaply though he did not really have to rush forward to the attack but kanté man of the match for lokmanyu there man of the match performance if he does actually manage to win one Cherry on top would be for him to score the goal because that's that's the only thing he hasn't done in this game. What a performance by the little man here! A great ball to Dinier. He tries to create one good chance, and that's a great chance, but that's a great tackle. Last ditch tackle by Lokman. You there? Like I said, this was bound to be the closest game that we have so far because everyone knows the quality. Yeah, that's a grave mistake by Lokman. You here, and that is going to be a goal. Like I said, this game was going to be all decided based on mistakes, and that's exactly what's happened. Lokman, you. in a very commanding position has made a mistake and a player of navin's quality is always going to take advantage of that especially when a ball is handed on a blue golden platter to him right at the death with his full back an easy pass the composure to have make that extra pass to marshall it was coming it was coming with the pressure that he was piling on it was either lokman you's mentality that kept him in this game or it had to be a mistake because it was extremely difficult uh, especially against the 4312 that he has switched to and with constant pressure it was always going to be an uphill battle for lokman you and with just a one goal lead he hasn't really created anything in the second half either it was just the one goal separating them and now it's 1-1 and what a game do have we have in our hands now Lemar on the wings. Very interesting to see if uh, Navin switches back to the four four two though. The four two three one four three one two was working so well for him. Can Mbappe clutch it? Theo Hernandez. Mbappe still keeps the ball. The glitchy body type that he does possess. Mbappe. Theo Hernandez reads it. This game is going golden goal. Ah. Oh. it was so tight you can see the frustration on lokmanyu's face there he is annoyed with himself he knows that the game was so close to be done four in game minutes guys four in game minutes is almost just 20 seconds i believe 20 30 seconds no that that's also a lot all he had to do is hold the ball there and that smallest decision of lokmanyu to go in the attack At the 80th minute, 82nd minute, he lost the ball there when he tried to play a very direct, risky ball to the center from his winger. That's when he lost the ball, and I mentioned it at that time that he had no need for him to go and make that final pass there to the center because he was already a goal up. All he had to do was wait and maybe create a 100% opportunity, but by playing it in the 100% safe way. And I mean, look at this. Look at this. He has tried to get get out of this pressure, and he has passed it straight to Mbappe there, and that's a great finish. I mean, this was a good goal by Lokman. He completely sold, and a great finish by Dembele. But we we are going to golden goal for Lokman. You again. It has to be the one goal that is going to separate the tie, and Lokman. You. 
did manage to clutch it up against Dhruv, but the difference being that Dhruv is not the opponent in this game. It's it's, it's the quality of Naveen. Nothing to take away from Dhruv. He played so well, but the experience, uh, uh, the difference in experience between both of those players is vast and. Loki knows that this is somewhere he, where he's have to where he has to concentrate and has to get so much pressure on Naveen that he does uh, get a clear scoring opportunity. He has received the invitation and he will be joining the game. Incredible scenes. We asked for excitement and we have got it. They'll be choosing France again. Same routine, set the tactics. Pretty sure they won't be going for all three tactics because it's only going to be one goal that is going to decide the game. He chooses to go with... Ah, that was kind of a noob mistake by Naveen there. Um, he chose to go with United when he was in fact France in the game. And um, he, Lokman, you should receive his invitation anytime now. Which he has. You can see he's calm, he's collected, he's trying to focus. He knows where he went wrong, he knows exactly what he did to not be in the lead. And actually, in the semi finals, it costed him so much. It'll be very harsh for him to go out of the tournament if, he, if this is the way uh, it's done. But I mean, it was it was too close to call anyway. It was too close to call anyway. They both played extremely professional games, not giving each other too many chances, not taking too many risks. Just the nerves, the pressure. It's 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 too much. It's too much when you're playing at the level that these guys are at. And we have kickoff in just a few seconds. We have kickoff. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the golden goal for Naveen versus Lokmanyu. Huh, let's see how this fares. Alright, out of respect, he's gotten the ball back because that's how the play ended the previous game. Theo Hernandez to Pavard. Pavard to Pogba. Lokmanyu will try his best to defend with all his might, he cannot concede a goal. And what a step that is by Dubois. What an incredible step that is. A good chance. Can he get there? No, Theo Hernandez. Too good. Oh, what? It could have been a mistake there from Naveen. You can see the nerves on both sides here. It could have been a grave error by Naveen here. And spaces are opening up. Of course, he cannot make the pass just yet because it's all been covered and good defending again. You can see that the game is turning out to be a little more end-to-end -end than we than the first one. Of course, this golden goal, they both want to score the first goal ASAP. But um, yeah, it's 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 looking like it's going to be a very end-to-end -end affair till the game, till this game goes on. Kante to Koman to Dubois, who has been so good in both in all these games. Kante, the man of the match for sure, on Kante wins the ball. Ben Yedder holds the ball up for Dembele. Back to Ben Yedder, wants to create a good attack, involves all of his players. He'll go to the center now. Give the ball to Pogba. Go wide. Or does not go wide. Maybe a mistake. Because Mbappe was clearly covered there. Good defending by Lokmanyu there. Mbappe trying to hold the ball back up. The, the thing with the 4-4-2 is you do have to rotate quite a bit. You have to rotate quite a bit uh, to actually be able to create good opportunities. Because good defenders like these ones it's going to be very hard to break down defenses. 
especially when there are two sentiments that you're going to have to beat and there's going to be a great chance can kuman get there a good chance for a shot he does take it of course can he go for a direct corner though he does not dinie passes the ball to kuman kuman to theo hernandez theo hernandez waits waits does not see anyone waits waits kante just nibbling at him the whole time duba passes the ball off to kuman kuman to yedo great press but gives the ball back to navin again he'll wa- it's it's slow build up it's it's it is what it is it's it's they're relying on a slow build up just so that we, they can make sure it's a it's a goal that comes out of each attack because each attack is so precious to them you never know when it, when it, when a game is going to turn on its head mbappe to yedor and that's going to be a goal what a finish by navin and that was some class composure that was class composure that 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 direction not make just just sold look when you entirely that was a great game what exciting stuff we are witnessing here navin with the clutch goal i mean i would have never the way that he turned back with ben yedder once and then he was like nah there's no way i'm beating the player and then he passed back to mbappe and then the one touch that they played the one two that they played with each other and then the l1 r1 directional a peach of a goal incredibly well played by navin very unlucky for lokmanyu that he couldn't hold on to the lead but well played to both of them one of the kgiest game that we've seen so far i mean this was probably the most uh highly competitive game that we've seen today the most by far i believe because this was so close so close between both of them not too much skill gap there but uh, navin made the clutch happen the beniedo scored the goal for him and we have navin in the semi finals what a quarter final run it has been and we will be back with the semi finals where saranj plays mohan vicky plays navin big 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 games are coming up it's the ones that we've all been waiting for it only gets better from here i will see you guys in some time